Hello there everybody, I'm Bix here with another uh, minifigure uh, collection display and this is for the Rebellion. So yeah, um, from the classic, as some people call it, the classic uh, trilogy. So uh, yeah, for episodes 4, 5, and 6, uh, these are all the good guys basically. So uh, we're gonna, I uh, took the liberty of including the uh, Ewoks and um, I got two of the kind of resistant trooper battle packs that's because they look kind of the same and generic so and they're not named characters so I could definitely use more as army building so let's take a look at the stance starting with the Ewoks so yeah I decided to add them in and this looks pretty good itself um, it's basically hmm sorry about the focus let's try to yeah there we go it's basically like a tree so they're <laughs> home you know they do build in trees i do own ewok village that's where i got these figures so go check that uh kind of review out and yeah this this thing just keeps coming undone and i have no idea why huh it should fit under there but anyway we got um all the ewok Shirpura, um the chief um that the medic the ewok warrior and his name starts with the t t-bone i believe yeah um so yeah, that uh, these go for um, kind of a lot because they've only ever appeared in two uh, different sets and I do have an extra of one. But anyway, uh, we're looking at a total of 35 figures by the way. So that brings my total uh, figure count uh, out of the stands I've viewed so far to 169 in case you were interested and are following around. Anyway, here is from Rogue One. Um, this is designed to look like the U-Wing, white bricks and blue, kind of the U-Wing color scheme, which I reviewed where I got these figures. Kazian Andor, a Ewing pilot, and Jin Air. So, you know, I would like to get Bodhi Rook, Vase Malvas, Chur Inwi, all that, but, you know, um, the sets are off the market now, and, you know, to get them all, you know, you had to pay, you had to buy, like, out all the sets of the way. Well, take a look at that last, actually. So, um, anyway, right here is for the droids. We got um, C3PO, but then we got a feature version of him from Star Wars 7, where he has that uh, kind of red uh, robotic arm right there. And then we got a BB-8, and we got two versions of R2-D2, regular R2-D2, and when he's all messy from Yoda's hut from episode 5. Here is the Resistance Army, small as theirs tends to be. But yeah, we got the Ewok ones, which are pretty popular because they are rare. One from Rogue One. Then all the ones from the Battle Pack, and don't forget Bastan from the U-Wing. He was supposed to be a main character in Rogue One, but... 40% by the way, no 60, sorry, 60% 60 of Rogue One was changed if you didn't know that originally, spoiler alert, they did not all die at the end. But anyway, here is the stand with all our main heroes, you know, of course the droids should be in there. And by the way, I did get some of the transparent bricks to show kind of uh, droid detailing. But anyway, uh, these are our heroes. So. Let's start with uh, Princess Leia. It's actually, um, I have most of the Han Solos, but uh, most variants of Han Solo. But for Princess Leia, we got Ewok Princess Leia, Hoth Princess Leia, Episode 4 Princess Leia. I'm hoping to get the updated one from Death Star Escape. For Luke's, I only got two, and that's because all the times Luke is a Jedi, I have a separate Jedi display stand. But anyway, here we have some Trooper Luke and Tatooine Luke. Back there, we have Chewbacca, the newer version. Han Solos, regular Han, Stormtrooper Han. Uh, when he's about to get uh, frozen, hun, and when he is frozen, hun. So, um, yeah, that is it for this uh, kind of video. I hope you liked it. Please subscribe, leave a comment down below, and I'll talk to you again soon. Bye.